Jade Equines and welcome to the vlog. It is currently Sunday the 3rd of October and I'm going to, I don't really know what I'm going to film. Uh, I asked a few of you on my, over on my Instagram page what you would like to see for this week's video um, and I got a few varied responses. One that came up quite a lot was a day in the life. So I'm going to attempt to try and film my whole day today kind of but it's not really a typical day in life because we are actually going somewhere exciting today we are going to Summerford Park not on horses uh, just on foot but I will explain a little bit about that later so I don't really know what this video is going to be it's not a typical day in the life because for one we're going to Summerford Park and I don't go to Summerford Park every day and two I am looking after or we me and my mum and a few other girls on the yard are looking after our friends two horses as well so I have to tend to them this morning and I don't usually have free horses to do I usually just have Cody so again that's not very typical either so this really isn't this is a really bad day in the life because this isn't what my day in the life looks like but however I am going to take you all along with us kind of hopefully as much as I can do um I need to start by getting out of this car and feeding said three horses and mucking them out and then turning them out so I'm going to do that first and then I will come back to you all and explain why we're going to Summerford Park Scout out. Some of you will recognise Scout from a few of our other videos. He actually came with us to the Hunter Trials um, last week, or the week before. Just done all of their beds and put Cody and Penny out because they're in the same field. He's coming. And now I'm just putting Scout out. But as you can tell, it's a very miserable day. So they've all got their good turnout rugs on and they'll only be going out for a few hours and then I'll bring them back in again. So that's what I'm currently doing. I've just got a few hay nets and waters to finish off um, and then I'll be going home. I'll probably have some brunch because I've not had any breakfast yet and I have no idea what time it is and I'm starving. So let's put you out, mister. Yeah. Good boy. Look at this weather. Look at this. Hideous weather. He's literally pelting it down and I've just finished all of the horses um, and turned them all out for a few hours. You will have last seen me turning the scout out. Um, but all of the jobs are done. Cody's bed, nice and fresh. Definitely won't look like that by the end of the day. The plan now is I'm just going to quickly nip home and I don't know if I'm going to get showered. I should probably get showered. Um, but get dry at least and clean. And then me and my friend Paige, who also is stabled here, are going to head down to Summerford Park. So the reason that we're going to Summerford, we aren't going to watch anything or ride. We are going to Summerford's amazing tack shop, Hope Valley Saddlery. They also have on a sample sale. So they advertised it on Facebook. I don't know if it's just clothing or if it's other items as well, horsey items. And they did say Ariat sample sale, so I don't know if it's just Ariat or there are gonna be other brands as well, but we just wanna go for a trip out really and see if we can get some bargains. I know you all enjoy seeing me spend money that I don't have. So I thought I'd take you all with me. We are hoping that we are gonna be able to get our hands on some really good horsey bargains and not come home empty handed. I don't know how busy it's gonna be there or how much I'm gonna be able to speak to you all in there, but I would definitely be filming and showing you pretty much everything that is in there. So I thought you might enjoy coming along with us. Travel 
get. Did you get a good bit? Good bit. We've done, we think we've done all right. A little bit. It was a lot. We couldn't really film in there because it was quite hectic and small. Well, there was a lot in there. I thought, to be fair, I think it would be sold out. No. Like, beforehand. But um, mostly smart guys are small and medium, not a lot of bigger stuff. Luckily, we fit into them, but I think we did all right. And now we're going to go into Hope Valley and exchange this breastplate that I got Kelly for. It's too big for Cody. And we'll probably spend more money that we don't have. And yet to love, yeah, I feel that. Yeah, I feel that. Yeah, you're up in space. You're inside the noise. I can feel you. Mm. Once you've seen all the things, all the places, I hope it means that you Look at all the rugs. It's ridiculous so i'm on the hunt for a really nice cooler for cody like a winter cooler for when she's traveling back and forth from lessons eventing and whatnot so i'm trying to find one that's like a bit thicker than just her usual mesh one but i'm not having much luck <laughs> it's all a bit random so many rugs so many rugs So Cody and Penny are in the same field. So Cody's in and I've just picked her feet out and I'm just gonna go and do the same with Penny and Scout. So I'm gonna quickly try and show you what I got today. If the light is a bit crazy, it's because Cody is in the stable with me and there you go, she keeps moving back and forth. Um, so apologies for that. And it is also really busy on the yard, so it's quite loud. But I am going to try and show you and give you a mini haul, because um, I know that you will all be asking and be interested in what I bought. I think there are a few items that I can't show you because they are for mum for Christmas, and she watches these videos. But I will show you everything that are Christmas presents, and that I bought for me. First thing that I bought was actually for mum, but not for Christmas, I'm gonna give that to her today when I get home, and that was a Ariat base layer. It has the logo here on the front, and then it also has Ariat on the back, on the collar, which I thought was really nice, and it was only 15 pounds, how good is that? So that was for mum, let me show you what I got for me. So firstly, I've got a new cap because as you will probably tell, I wear this cap literally every day and it is getting a bit worse for wear now. So I bought a new area denim cap and I paid six pounds for this, which is an absolute bargain. The next thing that I've got was a base layer for me. I've got it in this gorgeous purpley color and it has silver stitching of the logo here. And then what really made me buy it, to be honest, was this, hang on, was the writing down the arm. So I thought that was really cute. And if I'm buying Ariat, then I want people to know that it's Ariat, do you know what I mean? Um, even though I didn't pay full price for it. So I think I got this at 25 pounds. Again, it's an absolute bargain for Ariat clothing, especially a nice thick base layer like this. Um, this one is quite thick compared to the one that mum has, hence why that one was cheaper. This is more of a winter, autumn one, so I can't wait to wear this. Actually, it's to go with my new base layer, and that is this new gilet. Sorry, but how gorgeous is this gilet? So this was a small, and I paid £25 for this as well. So I can't wait to wear this with my matching base layer and i think probably these leggings that i've got are now the black equiel ones um to, oh cody's okay, just sat on my camera um hopefully to somewhere horsey i'm going somewhere horsey and exciting next weekend so maybe i'll wear it there 
So all in all, we actually managed to get some really good bargains. Um, nothing full price from Saddlery, but we did do well out of the sample sale. Cody's just been for a quick hack um, because clearly she had far too much energy before, didn't you? Come here, let me take that off you. Um, so I literally, let me turn you around, literally just whizzed around the block on her. Um, we're only out for about 10 minutes, but just to take the edge off it seems to have worked now i'm going to untack her and then get all of the horses fed and ready to go to sleep for the night hello you finished your tea okay let's wash that out here is scout so i'll let him finish his tea and then i'll pop uh, wash his bowl out and pop him to bed so i think i'm going to leave that video here at quite hope you enjoyed our very horsey day in life our little shopping spree more footage of me spending money that i don't have if you did enjoy this week's video then please make sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more weekly videos we post every sunday at 6 pm also feel free to follow us over on instagram our name is adele equine and i'll pop the link to that directly in the bio down below again thanks for watching this week's video equines and i will see you in next week's video bye <laughs>